in this lab we have two networks network 10.0.0.0 slash 24 and network 11.0.0.0 slash 24 our target in this lab is to make BCA in network 10.0.0.0 be able to reach BCD in network 11.0.0.0 we have also network 50.0.0.0 slash 30 which connects between the two routers router 1 and router 2 as you can see we substituted bca and bcd with routers in these routers we removed routing functionality and configured ib interface for their fast ethernet interface and uh, uh, configured a default gateway which is pointing to the routers interface in each network now, if we logged to BCA and made a ping to BCD, it will tell us that the destination is unreachable. This is why. This is because R1 until now, it doesn't know any information about network 11.0.0.0 slash 24. Until now, R1 can't reach network 11.0.0.0. And the same thing for R2. Also, it can't reach network 10.0.0.0 okay let's make this in practical way we first the console of BCA and make a Bing to 11.0.0.2 which is the IP address of BCD and press enter it will tell us that the destination is unreachable this is why this is because that if we enter to the console of R1 and to see its routing table, we should write show IP route and press enter. This command shows us the routing table of R1. Now we will see that R1 until now knows only about 50.0.0.0 and network 10.0.0.0 which are the networks that are directly connected to R1, this network and this network. But until now R1 can't see network 11.0.0.0. And the same thing for R2, we enter to the console of R2 and write show IP route to see the, route, the routing table of R2. We will see that R2 until now knows about network 50.0.0.0 and 11.0.0.0 which are the networks that are directly connected to R2 but it doesn't know anything about network 10.0.0.0. Now what we should do is to enter to R1 console and configure it to be able to reach 11.0.0.0 network and to log in to R2 and configure it to be able to reach 10.0.0.0 network first we log in to the console of R1 and enter to global configuration mode and tell them and tell R1 that if you need to reach 11.0.0.0 Send your data to, net to network interface 50.0.0.2 Your next hub IP will be 50.0.0.2 So, in the console we write IP route 11.0.0.0 which is this network and the subnet mask slash 24 which means 255.255.255 Dot zero and next to hub IB will be 50.0.0.2 50.0.0.2 and press enter now let's look at the routing table again show IP route now we will see that R1 can see network 11.0.0.0 which is configured using static routing The same thing we make with R2, we log into R2 console and configure R2 to be able to see network 10.0.0.0. In the R2 console, we enter to global configuration mode and uh, write IP route IP, oh, IP route the network 10 dot zero dot zero dot zero its subnet mask is two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot zero the next hop IB will be fifty dot zero dot zero dot one which is 
this interface now we should look at the routing table of R2 show IP route we will see that now R2 is able to see network 10.0.0.0 using static routing configuration so now R1 is able to reach network 11.0.0.0 and R2 is able to reach network 10.0.0.0 so now if we enter to BCA console and make a ping again to BCD 11.0.0.2 it should succeed oh it succeeded yes success rate is 100 percent so now bca is able to reach bcd using static routing configuration